Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builders Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the Rockwood number 640RE. This is a flush bolt. It's a residential flush bolt uh, by nature. It's residential in its uh, application typically. The size, the relatively small size, the RE, the radius corner, okay? You can get a 640, that would have a square corner down here at the bottom, but RE is radius corner. That's going to be this is a classic residential sort of design, meaning that it's a corner style flush bolt. It's three quarter inch wide. It's six inch tall. Okay, let's get the tape measure and check that. Three quarter wide, six inch tall, very typical. Top portion, I don't have that memorized, but inch and a quarter. Okay, this is shown in the 626 satin chrome finish, a very attractive finish for this bolt. Operated by the handle here. Okay. Projection. One inch. So you're going to get for sure a three quarter inch into the header. Uh, two screws are included with this bolt. Uh, for the body, I should say, one here and one here. A strike plate will be included. Two screws for that as well. I'm not going to cut it out of the packaging, but the description says it's 7 8 by 2 inch, and that's going to be very common. If you're replacing something, you probably won't even replace the strike plate whatsoever. This flush bolt is available in several different finish. Well, not several. It's available in common residential finishes, polished brass, um, antique brass, they call it brass satin oxidized relieved, that's just what we call antique brass, 609, then of course the 606, satin chrome, very typical, very common. Now there's a link below this video to the product brochure where you can review this and Rockwood's sister products, which is helpful, some surface bolts and then the square corner version of this residential flush bolt. Uh, there's also a link below this video to the template. The template shows dimensionally the preparation required for uh, the door itself. Okay, So if I was going to be mortising for this, uh, I would have really three setups for my router. First of all, I would have the body, which is going to give me all of the inner components of this. I would then have my plate. Well, yeah, I would I would have my body, which is going to be per the template, uh, five and a quarter inch from the top of the door down to here. The twenty-seven thirty seconds of an inch depth. I would then have a small amount of the plate to do, which is three quarter inch, and then just the thickness of the material, which is eighty thousandths. So just heavy on a 16th. I would then have the same little doodad I'd have to do at the top, my plate preparation here, but they're calling it all out to be three quarter wide. So you have three quarter wide, two flute router bit, 27 30 seconds of an inch deep, all the way down to the bottom, five and a quarter length, a little bit for the face here and here. And then your preparation is completed. Pre drill your holes and you're done. Okay, router is the best way to go. If you had one to do, um, you might do it with a hammer and chisel, but a router is the preferred uh, tool to use for any sort of uh, machining like this. What you'll note on here is an excellent fit and finish, and that is very common with all things Rockwood. Their fit and finish is by standard excellent and well above average. Uh, they are a comprehensive manufacturer of all things trim and auxiliary hardware related, not only flush bolts and surface bolts, but door poles, kick plates, push plates, door stops. They also get into uh, uh, overhead uh, door holders, pivot hardware, okay, things of that nature. And they have a comprehensive offering of architectural door poles under their RM series. You can review both of their full line catalogs by clicking below this video to the manufacturer's page where you can pull up both of those catalogs. Any questions on the Rockwood number 640RE? residential radius edge flush bolt or any other Rockwood product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you.